Yo, 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 it's Crypto Rocko here, and today we're talking about Litecoin. In this video, guys, I'll give you guys a full price prediction for Litecoin. Before you shoot me down, I'm not saying it will go to a thousand dollars. Let me explain, let, let watch this video, and let me explain why I've put a thousand dollars in the video title. So, Litecoin, guys. With this news that came out recently, Litecoin went up 10%, I believe. Um, it went up massively and then now the whole market is consolidating. So Litecoin is going down. I actually sold some at the top because if I have a big position in a coin, when it goes up 10, 20%, I always like to take a bit of profit. If it goes down, I buy back. If it doesn't go back, I still make some profit. But I hate to see coins going up and then going down that's just a quick trading tip down there so if you guys want more trading tips videos price predictions and that everything about cryptocurrency follow me on on at crypto Rocko, guys and subscribe to my channel it means a lot to me it doesn't cost you anything but it really means a lot to me and it motivates me to do a lot of video i've gained almost a thousand subscribers very very quickly so i'm doing a litecoin giveaway as a thank you to my subscribers so if you are interested guys subscribe to my channel hit the like button and put your Litecoin address below in the comments and I'll give you guys half a Litecoin. So the news that came out for Litecoin is Litecoin surges after the CEO of American Express backed crypto startup um, explains why it's moving away from Bitcoin for smart contracts. So Abra is the company that they came up with this news and the guy it's called Bill, the CEO, came up with the news that they'll be moving to Litecoin and this is what's caused the massive news massive uh, price jump in litecoin and and it they, they actually they actually came up with the news a while back but this post in reddit where the the abra ama on reddit litecoin reddit caused the price jump because people took it seriously so it went up up to almost up to 15 percent. i took profits at 10 percent. so it's a high profile crypto startup is backed by american express it I mean, could be. I'm not saying American Express will will start working with Litecoin, but it could be a step in the right directions. I mean, Charlie Lee and the people in Litecoin can be can start building contacts with American Express. As you guys know, I'm a huge fan of Litecoin. I'm very bullish in Litecoin, and sometimes my um. I try to be unbiased, but sometimes it's difficult not to be biased because I'm looking for positive information about Litecoin. I was disappointed with Litecoin when the Litepay and the Litepal fiasco, but this is positive news that's coming out for Litecoin. So, you know, we went to with Litecoin as a second asset class and three reasons they mentioned was commitment to Bitcoin compatibility. So the roadmap, the support, lightning, lightning support, slightly better scalability than Bitcoin. I think Litecoin scalability needs to be even better, but they're doing a decent job for now. Cryptocurrency is still at a very informed, uh, very informed, very uh, new, new state. They're still developing, so it's not a developed market yet. So there is room for growth, and we need to cut some, give them some slack because it takes time to develop a market. It took years to develop, um, you know, the dot com bubble. It take it took years for it to be where it is. It, initially, there there were a lot of difficulties. So mining fees, which are primarily a function of number two, although this is more short term benefit as mining fees would likely skyrocket if we are successful anyway. So this is uh, this is the three reasons what uh, Bill, I'm not going to try and <laughs> attempt to pronounce his second name. The, the first the shift first announced end of March. But, you know, when it was um, after the Reddit AMA, that that's when the price uh, jump happened. But this is great news, guys. You know, they this is a positive step forward for litecoin and that's why you know i've titled it i've, I've gone for a crazy number like a thousand for litecoin prediction but people are really interested in altcoin and abra could abra will give massive access to more more people to buy bitcoin and cryptocurrency i'll talk about abra in a bit so this is the interview guys i'm not going to read it or read it through all i'll advise you guys to read it if you're interested i would highly recommend that you read this because this is a very if you're interested in litecoin you'll learn a lot about it there is a reputation so it talks about the three reasons again so i've highlighted this bit that i wanted to show you i should also point out that we will add native support for other cryptocurrencies in the app as the demand goes up as this lowers our cost of offering the service maintaining the smart contracts as a fixed daily cost to abra which holding native cryptos does not so this is guys this is massive guys abra what they're trying to do guys is abra will help um 
give access to cryptocurrency markets to hundreds and thousands of people and more access there is more money will be allowed to come into cryptocurrency there was another point he talked about he, he's just not talking about cryptocurrencies he's talking about stocks and commodities as well so you know he wants someone in in ghana or bangladesh or india to buy exposure uh, to apple or somewhere in indonesia to buy exposure to alibaba so they've got a massive vision guys and as they and for a company with a massive vision good backing from american express if they can deliver guys it will be massive and it's good that they like litecoins because if litecoin get can get into abra's a uh, good books they will promote litecoin a lot more so like i've said guys this is very very positive news and just at the end, I'll read this bit as well. Our vision is to build non-custodial crypto bank that <laughs> this is a de democrat democratizes access to final financial service for every consumer on the planet. Investment access, so things that I've already talked about, payment with money transfer, and um, credit services. I've talked about publicly via um our recent fox investment where my favorite example is hardware as a service using abra smart contract to facilitate uh, payments so again this is really really positive news and the market has reacted accordingly with the 15 percent price jump and um, another thing that the same guy mentioned all hell will break loose i've talked about this before guys i think money will come in and um, I've, I've i've said that i think bitcoin might have one last leg down but money will be coming in and this guy is saying that he's been talking to hedge funds and high net worth individuals that are waiting to bring money into the cryptocurrency markets. I've, I've made this video where I talk about what's wrong with the cryptocurrency, which I'll highly recommend you watch. But the main thing is, guys, it, once there's less scam and people doing their own research before investing, there's going to be more money coming in because high net individuals are more scared to buy into cryptocurrencies. Once it, there's more accessibility for cryptocurrencies, more money will come in. So when more money comes in, the institutional money comes in, Wall Street money comes in, that when we see a massive hike in prices so this is this is a big big positive and a massive signal for a, a positive signal for a crypt, uh, cryptocurrency in 2018 so this is abra's website guys i'll just take you through what they're trying to say it, i will kind of be repeating myself a little bit so i'm not going to go through it all so only global app that allows to buy and store and invest 20 cryptocurrency in one place and what they're trying to i'm not sure whether um, I've, whether i've got that um website uh, the article that i read but abra is trying to not trying to be like binance or gdax they're more trying to um go to the retail investors so they don't want uh, their customers to have to learn how to transfer bitcoin how to use wallets and how to use an exchange they want to make it very simple and this simplicity could be key for getting further investment into our community which will see prices go up not just for litecoin if you're investing in a good project there's loads of good projects i know there's thousands of wrong bad projects that i would not recommend you invest but if you are invested in good projects when money comes in you will reap benefits for it so you know it talks about investing in bitcoin and another thing i want to show you is they are they've got 20 uh, cryptocurrencies that you can invest in so they have really upped their game coinbase need to watch out because coinbase currently is only doing four um, and they've got plans to do more erc20 token i believe so vetcoin this is a coin i've invested i've been invested in for a while so it's good to see them on here this will give them some exposure although they've they've gone a bit dead so i'm not saying invest in vetcoin Charlie Lee, guys, if you're invested in Bitcoin, guys, you need to be following this guy. Charlie Lee, uh, I, I did lose some respect for him when with all the light pay fiasco. I mean, he didn't need to apologize, but he came out. He didn't owe, owe us an apology. He came out and apologized for it. So um, I've still got respect for him. I, I really hope he delivers. So it talks about the article that I looked at, guys, Abra's um, article, because it's a big news for Litecoin and Charlie Lee. Um, he posts really interesting stuff. Ask not what ask not what Litecoin can do for you. Ask what you can do for Litecoin. Flappening. This brings us on to the next point in the video title. Um aligned payments as well, so that's good. So flappening is when Litecoin 
goes over Bitcoin Cash. It's dropped now. I think it was 61% when Litecoin was going up. But overall, it has gone up massively. And I really hope this happens, guys, because I'm not a fan of Bitcoin Cash. If you follow me, guys, you know that I do not like Bitcoin Cash. I do not see their value proposition, <laughs> apart from saying that they're the best Bitcoin. I do not see what their value proposition is. So I really hope that this flattening happens. I'm not saying it will happen in 2018, but I definitely see it happening in the future um litecoin foundation guys this is a good um this is another twitter account to follow if you're into litecoin they post really interesting stuff post the ama and um, what i've just talked about in abra reddit um litepal so again i Litepal, I'm not going to comment too much on it because I've done my research on Litepal and I've still got some concerns. But they're basically saying they're different to Litepay. So, you know, Litepay failed. So they're trying to do something similar and they're saying they'll deliver. So I'm not I'm not I'm not that hopeful on Litepay, Litepal, to be honest. But if they can deliver, it will be massive. If you want to do your own research on it, go on to their website, guys, or, or Twitter account uh, or Reddit or read some articles on it and you'll find out more about it. And Reddit, guys, I always say, guys, you you can communicate and have, have really good discussions um, and find out really good information about Litecoin and your favorite cryptocurrencies on Reddit. Um, so what's going on on here? One of the articles that I want to show you is how Abra is paving the way for Litecoin. This is a quite a good article. It talks about um some of the things we've already talked about in the in the other articles but it just shows how abra can be massive for litecoin guys so uh to cover up guys my price prediction of thousand i'm not saying it will go to thousand but if you if you look at all the money coming in there's a really the consensus event that's going on and 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 it's the the, the bull run is eminent everyone is talking about it's going to happen and i'm not i think it might drop again i'm not saying it will go down to three thousand or two thousand but it will probably Probably drop again a uh, bitcoin i see it happening it might not guys i'm just speculating guys it's my technical analysis that's what he's saying but i'm very bullish on the overall cryptocurrency market in 2018 unless there's you know really bad news come out um but i think cryptocurrencies and bitcoin will have a really really good year this year especially litecoin and to predict to go to thousand is probably a bit far fetched, but I've predict at the start of the year I've predicted six hundred for Litecoin and I stand by that. But if Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies go crazy, like what we saw last year, by end of last year where everyone was investing in Bitcoin and cryptocurrency, I'm not saying that's healthy, but if money comes in from institution institutional um institutional money comes in and Wall Street gets invested guys it could happen i'm not saying it will it could but i'm very bullish on litecoin and this abra's news is amazing and i really hope flappening happens and i hope charlie keeps del delivering and we could see wild worldwide adoption or a very preliminary start of people accepting litecoin because one of the hashtags that we use on twitter is pay with litecoin Again, uh, Charlie's using it, pay with Litecoin. So we are trying to drive the adoption. I haven't got that chart, guys, where it talks about, you know, Litecoin's transactions going up, although the price is going down. So that is what we need to look at. People using Litecoin, the adoption of Litecoin and not the price. Although I'm speculating Litecoin goes to 500 or 1,000, it's the key, is the adoption and the value that Litecoin provides to the world that is important. So thank you very much for watching this video, guys. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you've enjoyed it, guys, smash smash that like button, share it with your friends and family and subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys soon with another great video. Go Litecoin!